Why, hello there. Melanie Murphy, no longer vegan. But she's Irish. It's okay, lass. You don't have to drink the four-leaf clover smoothies anymore. Okay, so Melanie Murphy, popular YouTuber that I've never heard of because I don't watch these chatty girls. I don't watch them. And I was watching this video and I'm thinking, I'm not gonna make it to the end. She's talking about her makeup and I would just, I didn't think I would survive to the end of it, but I did. So right away, first impression, she does not eat food for its health values. She doesn't do it. She's talking about potato chips and Diet Coke and I'd wanna punch her in the fallopian tubes. Those aren't health foods. It doesn't matter if you're vegan or you're not. You can't eat deep fried shit all the time and salt, oh my God, she is salty. All these high sodium foods. I mean, I went to get a soup one day and I looked at it and I was like, if I eat this whole jar to get enough calories, it's gonna be like 3000 milligrams of sodium. You can't live off processed foods and be healthy. It's a treat. So she's eating all these processed foods and tuna salad sandwiches? You mercury bitch. Why? And then salmon for dinner? You didn't have enough mercury for lunch? Maybe don't base your diet off heavy metals. That's my tip. In fairness to her, she has a big swim coming up upstream. She wants to lay her eggs in the ocean. And I mean, she has to learn all she can from a salmon, so she has to eat it to really fully envelop herself in the salmon wisdom, to know the best routes to take, to avoid the bears and the fishermen. So cut her some slack, she needs it. She likes her comfort food. She has the hot chocolates, ice cream cookie dough sandwiches. She must not like to poo. I mean, she says being vegan is difficult, no. Pushing an ice cream sandwich out of your ass is difficult. You wanna talk about effort, that's effort. Vegan's easy, rice and beans and veggies, soy sauce, coconut oil, easy, delicious. Ice cream out of your ass, that's hard. Anyways, so she goes on talking about paleo brainwashing theories and the vegan diet's been debunked and our brains are only big because we ate meat. It was in that book written by a fucking lion he wrote that book and lions also discovered how to manipulate gravity so they could bend time and space to travel into the future. And they've discovered how much worse Melanie Murphy's bowel movements will smell in 10 years if she continues on this path. And the early reports are in, it's bad. It's really bad. She has tuna poo, tuna poo. Okay, I wanna get serious for a second here. It's not easy for me. She said she saw a paleo guy that looked really healthy and this convinced her to eat meat again because he looked so healthy. And I just gotta say that's the worst way to base your decision on what to eat. I mean, I used to do that myself. I'd look at these people, oh, he looks healthy. He must be doing great. Look how healthy Lance Armstrong looked. He had testicular cancer. You can't tell the health of somebody inside by looking on the outside. I've seen so many people coming out of McDonald's with perfect skin. Trust me when I say McDonald's is not the key to perfect skin. It's just some people do not flush toxins out of their skin, they're lucky. They don't look, they don't get the zits. I mean, that's just a genetic makeup. They suffer in other ways, believe me. But there is a secret, I'm gonna share it with you right now, how to tell if somebody's healthy. There's only two colors of eyes, brown or blue. Bear with me now. There's true brown eyes, which I have, and there's blue. If you ever see somebody with blue to green to hazel to some blue with brown, some blue with green, these are all just varying levels of toxicity in the body. Melanie Murphy has green eyes. She should have blue eyes, but she's a little toxic. She can get rid of that on a lot of fruits and veggies and they will go back to blue. So if you're a fan of hers, you're watching her channel or you're Melanie Murphy yourself watching this, pay attention to your eyes. And if they start going brown, you know you're going the wrong way. You're getting toxic, especially around the pupil. If that starts going brown, 
That's your colon area. There's all kinds of charts you can look up online. It's called iridology. So I can see it in her eyes. Her eyes are green, they should be blue. She's not as healthy as she could be. And I'm a little worried if she continues on the paleo route, that's just gonna get worse, not better. You need the fruits and veggies to clean out. So that's about all I gotta say on it. Do you wanna hear Brett Rawlings' opinion? Tell me, do you? I can feel it. I'm, I'm getting a resounding yes. Let me send him the video for the purpose of health and weight loss. So I started incorporating everything into my diet again, including meat and some dairy. Bye, Murphy. I've tried reaching out to you in your comments section and I haven't heard back. If I don't hear something within the next 48 hours, the next time you see me, I'll be stood at your front door, and that is the last thing you want, sweetheart. I promise you that. Get this sorted fast. Vegan gains big beautiful black man but could my ass handle that dick i don't fucking think so i'd like to walk again thanks hi holly how's it going pow listen